Dude, let's go! What are you doing in there, dude? You ready? Yeah, let's get this done. Ever since they turned green, they've got mean. Ooh, I like yeah. that. I like that. What do you that. think about that all night, or just come up with that? Uh, I just came up with That's that, wild. Eric. I like actually, that. Uh, no, cool. seriously, you guys, Royobi. Uh, they've always been a pretty decent brand, you know, kind of the entry level brand at Home Depot. Um, ever since they did turn green, was pretty much when they went with the One Plus Lithium, mm -hmm. and uh, their products have just, you know gone gangbusters since then uh if you're if you're even a pro i'm not knocking them pros i've seen use where we've seen a lot of pros using here in the chicago area because tools get st uh, stolen a lot or lost or beat and you know it's just easier and cheaper to go buy a royal drill every six months than it is to buy a high-end one for four times the cost exactly. and get it stolen it sucks it breaks your heart um recently we did the black and decker blue glue gun yeah which we love, which was one of love the first it. cordless ones to market. I and gotta say, I use that all the time. Really? I got kids, yeah, always fixing stuff. They always got craft stuff for school, so it's so nice. I always had a plug-in one. The Black and Echo one's been great. I'm excited about using that one. Honestly, we use it a lot. I got an eight and a six-year-old, so they're always doing stuff, stuff for school. So it's been huge. And then all the stuff they break. Yeah, yeah, no, glue guns that. are cool. I mean, you never know when you don't need them. And the cool thing about a glue gun is you can always break the bond if you need to. Yes, not permanent, yeah, exactly. But yeah. it holds it really good. Right, yeah. Like I held my electric uh, cabinet up underneath my desk, and it held it for the longest time until I kicked it one day and it came down, mm. bashed me in the knees. A uh, couple cool features about this, you guys, is it has a two-finger trigger. So when you pull, you're giving a little bit, it's a little bit easier for you to pull that off. And there goes some glue. Obviously, with any glue gun, you're always going to get the little stringy yeah. thing at the end. But this does a pretty good job of not getting... That too. Obviously, the tip is hot. Nice rubber. Wow, it's really hot up in here. It is. Yeah. Um, it's almost like it's a hot glue gun. Yeah, could be. The tip does come off too. I think so. You can clean it. Okay, cool. Turn this off, you guys, and it's off. Uh, runs off pretty much any one plus battery. Uh, Runtime is what? It's three and a half hours, but it's on the four amp hour battery, which is. I mean, you're gonna get a lot done at three and a half hours, so that's good. So I'd imagine yeah. two. Two would be. And I mean, but a lot of people too do leave it on because if I'm working on a project, yes, I don't want to have to keep exactly. turning it That's on and off. That's a good so point. for three hours, you're sitting there. You know, if you need more than three hours, just have another battery charge yeah. and you're ready to go. I mean, you could swap why this thing's on and it's going to maintain the heat. It's not going to cause any issues. How much is this? I think it's 29 bucks. Roughly about $29, but that's for the bare tool. A lot of the Royalby stuff comes with bare tools unless you get like a drill kit. So that's the one thing I like about Royalby stuff is that you can, very inexpensive quality stuff, I think, for an inexpensive price. Yeah, I'm a fan of Royalby, you guys. Uh, 29? 29 bucks. 29 bucks. You can only get it at your Home Depot. You might see them on Amazon sometimes. Um, but yeah, real nice tool. I love the ergonomic grip on it. I love the rubber overmold here, you know. Um, it's just a good useful tool to have around everybody should have one yeah and it's not a knock against the black and decker one but this actually battery charges in a regular battery the, the black and decker one i want to say the charge time on that thing was a lot longer yeah the black With and this Decker's one's more, your typical half yeah. hour to an hour this is going to be more tool guy related black yeah. and decker's more of a like a home Homeowner, brand crafts, but, arts and crafts yeah and, and i mean there's nothing wrong with that it still charges but like eric said for the guy that really when he's going to mm -hmm. have a use i'd probably choose this over the black and decker um but i do like black and decker yeah Cool. What's so, next? Good stuff. You get well. Actually, that's it for this video. Oh, that's right. Tools and action, you guys. Hashtag TA crew wherever you go. Support our sponsors. Don't forget to uh, go over to toolsandaction.com where you can click on the power tool form and follow us on Instagram. You guys, crazy, crazy things happening on Instagram. Check it out. Tools and action. For more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.